What's going on traders? It's Nate here at the Forex University. In this video, I'm just gonna do a comparison between FTMO and the 5%ers. Uh, there's a ton of people inquiring about FTMO, and then there's also the 5%ers that made some updates uh, to their prop trading firm. So I'm just gonna give you my opinion on what I think um, is better suited for each kind of trader. Um, and I'm just gonna give you the pros and cons in my opinion about like how each prop firm will actually benefit you long term. Uh, if you decide to work with a prop trading firm, okay? Also, if you stay to the end of this video, I'm gonna share a link that gives you access to my free private group. I do live sessions, I share my trade ideas, and we just have fun. There's people from all across the world that are in this chat group, so feel free to join it and uh, have some fun with us. And if you're new to this channel, go ahead and smash that like button, comment, and subscribe. It really means a lot to me because I'm just giving out value right now. So if you guys get any value out of this, feel free to support me. Okay, so FTMO. All right, so you can actually take um, multiple types of challenges. There's a $10,000 one, a 25, a 50, and a 100K. Um, I would recommend at least doing the 50 or 100K because you're gonna have more capital. Um, and then here are the parameters. You have actually two um, challenges you have to take. The first one is a 30 day trading period um, and you have to gain around 10%. You have to gain 10% in 30 days. And then once you pass that, um, you actually go to the next level and do the verification process. The verification is essentially um, a 60 day window to gain 5% um, of account of an account. Um, and then you would actually become, become a funded FTMO trader. Okay. Um, so you actually don't have 30 days because you don't trade on the weekend. So it's really like 20 days. And then um, let's say you gain 10% uh, in five days. Um, you still have to wait um, until 10 days are up to go to the next part. Okay. Um, it is a challenge. Um, I mean, it, it's not easy. So just make sure you're, you know, trading with proper risk management. That way you can pass the test. And then the second, uh, I mean, pass the challenge. And then the second, which is called the verification, um, you have about 40 actual trading days because you're, you know, there's the weekends you, you can't trade. Um, and that one's a little bit more or less stressful. And then you, you only have to gain 5%. After you become funded, um, you know, same thing, you have to trade for a minimum of a 10 days and uh, you still have the same parameters, um, but you aren't limited to um, a certain a certain time frame, right? Like all you need to do is trade 10 days worth. And then um, if you make, let's say $10,000, uh, you would invoice FTMO uh, 70%, which would be seven grand. Um, and then it, it would deposit into your bank account. Okay, um, I like FTMO because um, it it keeps you grounded with uh, proper risk management, um, so you can't lose more than five thousand dollars in a day, and that's including floating trades. So let's say, for instance, you lose twenty five hundred dollars on one trade, and then um, you enter another trade where you're in drawdown of like $2,500, okay? But it, end, it eventually goes your way and you make five grand profit. Well, you still are gonna lose your account because um, it's, it's, it's floating negative, right? So you, you wanna be mindful of uh, the total amount of loss you have in the day so you don't actually um, lose your account, okay? Um, the, the only thing that I don't, I don't like is once you get funded, you actually have to uh, not trade on Fridays. Like you have to close your trades because you can't hold any trades on the weekend. Um, and then there's like news event restrictions. So you can't trade any major news events, uh, but they'll highlight the news event and um, just make sure you're paying attention to it so you don't mess up and then lose your account for that as well. Um, the five percenters, in my opinion is pretty cool as well <clears throat> they're a little bit more lax with the actual program um, but the spot the the profit split is only 50 percent so again um, if you do the eighty thousand dollar one you sign up okay uh, you actually get twenty thousand dollars instantly and your goal is to actually generate 
$2,400 in the aggressive, which is 12% within 60 days. Okay, so you actually have a longer amount of time to pass that. Um, and then you have one to 30 leverage, okay? Once you generate $2,400, then you're gonna get funded 80,000, okay? And then, um, then you'll be able to profit split 50% um, of that $80,000 account, okay? Um, it, it's pretty cool because, you know, once you uh, continue to grow these accounts, let's say you get 25% um, from 80 uh, to, um, you know, whatever 25%, uh, 25 extra percent of $80,000 is, then they'll fund you more capital. So you can actually trade up to $1.2 million. Um, the, the only downside is your profit splitting 50%. So you're actually trading a little bit more capital than FTMO because FTMO, you can actually trade up to three accounts, which is $300,000. Um, and this one, you are, you're actually trading like 600 and some change, $600,000. So technically you're trading a little bit more capital, um, but the, the parameters are just a little different. The cool thing about 5 percenters is you can hold your trades on the weekends and they don't restrict you to news events. Um, so if you like that freedom, then I would recommend the 5 percenters.